Really? Well, um, what do you think my expertise is in, hmm? Stealing corporate secrets from dying men. I'm offering you a job. Thank you, but, um, I'm not interested in makeup. At the hospital. Part owner, remember? I could use someone with your skills on the business side of things, and you can't make parole without a job, so what do you say? Well, I say, um, <clears throat> stop working me. I and almost ended up here. Yes, but you didn't. I was married to someone that everyone hates. So what, now you want to bond over our bad marriages? No, I'm just saying that we have a lot in common. We both have made huge mistakes. I've gotten a fresh start. I'm offering to help you find yours. And just maybe we can help each other. This is about more than me just shuffling papers at the hospital. I lost two years of my life. I'm finally where I want to be, living the life I want to live with the man I love. I'm not going to let anything get in the way of that. Something tells me this is where I come in. It's not that difficult. All you have to do is get to know a gorgeous blonde. Is that a problem? Hmm. I'm not really sure, but I don't think ex-cons are considered quality dating materials. I hate to break it to you, but you're not exactly a hardened criminal. So take the job and the hottie. Yeah, but what if I'm not her type? She already likes you. Madison North, she was here just a little bit ago. Oh, well, she was pretty upset. Yeah, and you held her hand. Befriending her is just the next step. Why? She's a girlfriend. <clears throat> you do not do girlfriends, OK? Oh, well, except Kendall. So now tell me, why are you playing Little Miss Matchmaker? Oh, of course, yes. What? Yes, yes. Ryan was dating Madison, and you want to make sure that she is uh, <clears throat> occupied. She's not getting the picture that Ryan has moved on. Oh. Greenlee, that is so cold. No, it's not. I feel for her. Ryan let her down as gently as he could, but she's taking it really hard, and I thought a great guy like you might help her get over him. Really? Don't you mean get her to lean on me so she won't go leaning on Ryan? You can be very charming when you want to be. Look. Just call her. What are you talking about? Make a I'm date. Still in prison. Just I'm call her. You know what? I got a better idea. This will be really fun. I'll call Ryan and clue him in. Unless, of course, he already knows about your plan to find a home for his dumped ex-girlfriend. Why are you being so difficult? You were afraid that he has feelings for her, or that he could, hmm? Are you going to do it or not? <clears throat> well, for what you are asking, you're going to need to make it worth my time. Make the call within the hour, or the deal's off. That right there is an excellent negotiating tactic. I mean it. You need me. You need me. Think about it. You're still here. I'm glad I caught you. Hey, the big fusion emergency. Everything OK? Yeah, I think I took care of the problem. I should know soon. So uh, what do you guys have your heads together about? Kendall. Let me guess, the Chinese takeout, she's hungry again. Well, you did bail on dessert, you know. I know, I know, and I'll make it up to her and you, but it couldn't be helped. I mean, you remember how crazy Fusion can get, the suppliers, the retailers, the models, photographers. <laughs> I bet you're glad you can look for some work someplace not quite so insane. Um, Kendall hired me back. What? Kendall asked me to work for her, and I agreed. Are you sure this is what you want? It's not like I'll be in the office. I mean, I'll be working out of Kendall's house, so. You'll hardly ever see me. Nobody will. I mean, Kendall could use the help, right? Madison knows fusion. The boys love him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, congrats on the job. Thank you. Okay. Some place you got to be? Actually, there is. That business problem isn't solved exactly just yet. Everything OK? Yeah, it will be, once I get everything under control. Okay. Hey. Hey. What the hell are you doing? What oh. happened to the call? Oh, uh, yeah, that I decided against it. You're turning down a great job and the chance to get close to one of the hottest women in Pine Valley? No, listen, I like Madison. Then what's the problem? Oh, there is no problem. <clears throat> 
I'm just going to be doing it my way.